especially, you know, I'm always concerned we get deeper into the fall. We get a lot dark. of fog around mm -hmm. here, right? Mm -hmm. It's dark and we get fog oftentimes uh, in the fall as the kids go back. But uh, no fog out there really in Charlotte this morning, a little bit in the mountains. But boy, what a stretch of weather, huh? How about this? Our temperatures, of course, last week, for last Friday, we were close to 90, then near 90 both days, Saturday and Sunday, but it has been downhill. Now, yesterday, we started to bump back up a little bit, 81 after a morning low of 59, and we're back into the 50s again this morning, but we'll be just a smidge warmer this afternoon. Again, part of why it feels so great out there is because the air is so dry. The dew points are down into the 50s. Again, that is the comfortable range. Most of the summer, they've been in the upper 60s to even low 70s. Now, of course, the air is dry, meaning not not much in the way of cloud cover, so forget about rain. So here's the thing. If you got your lawn, your garden, you're trying to get back into shape here for late summer into the fall. Yeah, we're going to get it a little bit hotter as we head towards Tuesday and Wednesday. So yeah, you better get the garden hose out or turn on the irrigation system because Mother Nature, frankly, not going to be much help in the rain department here, at least in the short term. We're 57 right now in Rock Hill, Denver, up to Westport, Statesville, Mooresville, 56, Kannapolis. Good morning, Salisbury. You're at 54, 59 here in Charlotte and 56 now around Wingate and Monroe. So it stays nice. Mid 70s in the mountains today, low to mid 70s and lower 80s here across the foothills, the Piedmont and the Sandhills. You want to fire up the grill this evening. You are good to go again. No rain chance really 82 here at five o'clock will be in the low 70s by nine o'clock. Overnight lows are going back down close to 60. Outlying areas will be in the 50s weekend. Mostly sunny skies just a little bit hotter here as we go into Sunday. Dew points will start to come up a little bit as well, so it won't be quite as refreshing as we head towards uh, the uh, early start of next week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday as dew points start to get up into the stickier range and along with that comes higher heat as well. You thought summer was over with not so fast. We're going back into the low to mid 90s here, so we have sort of stalled now with this recent nice dry, uh, dry stretch of weather, uh, but we're going to be adding to our total here of 90 degree days. Also, rain chances are very low until we maybe get towards the end of next week and only then it's gradual. We see some model data starting to suggest that some rain comes back here towards Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. We'll keep our fingers crossed by then we're going to need it for today, though. We're looking great. 82 degrees tomorrow, 86. You're going to be tailgating. It will be very warm. You'll need the sunscreen during the day, but in the evening should be great for the FC match starting near 80, ending near 70. And of course, Sunday we've got a day game for the ascent. That's going to be a hot one. So do remember that we're in the upper 80s with mostly sunny skies. Very, very warm and just a little more humidity coming our way as well. And then into the 90s next week.